it is used to record the cash transactions of an entity. So what is the cash book? I'm Thomas Harwood and welcome to the Accounting Student where we create free and short videos so that you can learn about accounting. Today's video is looking at what is the cash book. Referring to the video on recording transactions in the accounting system, all the cash transactions of an entity are recorded originally in the cash book. The cash book is a main type of the books of original entry. However, the cash book, unlike the other books of original entry, is treated as a ledger account. Therefore, like a ledger account, the cash book will have a debit and credit side. A cash book can be defined as the book to recall day-to-day -day transactions of an entity and more specifically cash transactions. The cash book contains both the cash account and the bank account in one account. There are two types of cash books. They are two column cash books and three column cash books. The two column cash book will usually look something like this. The receipts of money are recorded on the left hand side known as the debit side. The payments of money are recorded on the right hand side known as the credit side the dates column record the date of the transaction the details column record the name of the corresponding account which needs to be debited or credited to complete the double entry of the transaction the folio column provides a quick reference of where the other accounts can be found in the accounting system for example the general ledger would be GL the sales ledger would be SL and the purchase ledger would be PL. Then the debit column for cash is drawn next to the debit column for bank and the credit column for cash is drawn next to the credit column for bank. On the other hand, the free column cash book will usually look something like this. It pretty much looks like a two column cash book, which is true. The only difference between the two types is that the free column cash book has a discounts allowed column on the debit side between in the folio and cash column and there is a discounts received column on the credit side between the folio and cash column. The balance brought down for a cash book represents how much cash is in hand and the money left in the bank account at the end of a period. In some cases the cash book can have balances brought down on both sides and it will look like this. The cash will always be brought down on the debit side like so as a business cannot have negative cash. The bank however can be brought down on the credit side as well as the debit side like so. If the balance brought down is on the credit side then it means that the business has taken out a bank overdraft. This means that the business is allowed to pay more money out of the bank account than the total amount deposited in the bank. So that was the explanation of the cash book. If you enjoyed it press the like button. If you have a question you want answered, leave it in the comments below and we'll try our best to answer it. And if you're not already subscribed, make sure you click the red subscribe button to keep updated with the accounting student. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.